Hey y'all, Billy here from Strong's Adventures. And today what we've got for you is our Cast Iron Wednesday April Challenge. Now, if y'all don't know, which everybody knows, that Cast Iron Wednesday was started by D from Native Tears. Go check her out. And Sean from Shovelhead 8 is one of the Cast Iron crew that keeps up with everybody. So, y'all hang on and I'll show you what we're gonna make. Okay, so what we're doing today for our April breakfast challenge for Cast Iron Wednesday, we're gonna make a mountain man breakfast. But everybody makes a mountain man breakfast, Billy. Yeah, but they make it for like eight, 10 people. This, I would like y'all to meet Teeny. This is Teeny. Y'all met Beulah in our last video. This is teeny. This is more for like one or two people. So, in these trying times where everybody's isolated, I'm cooking just for me. Y'all hang on, and we'll get some bacon frying, because everybody likes bacon. All right, so let's get this party started. We're gonna start it out with some bacon. I'm gonna be using four pieces of bacon cut into thirds. And if y'all can't tell, the smoke's about to kill me. Ooh, let's reach around and turn that knob up. Bacon porn. Okay, so that was four pieces of bacon cut into thirds. And uh, now we're gonna get our sausage. Brown that up. All right, we've got our Bacon and sausage grease. Now, we're gonna take about, uh, probably about a cup and three quarters of frozen hash browns. I also have some onions and some bell peppers in here. We're gonna go ahead and uh, get those cooked up. Now, I happen to, I happen to like uh, the Uncle Steve's Gator Shake. If y'all don't know who Uncle Steve is, y'all need to go see Uncle Steve. So, I'm just gonna season these hash browns with a little bit of gator shake. Because I do shake this on everything. We'll let those brown up a little bit with the uh, cover on the pot. Don't forget. That's teeny, cause she's teeny tiny. All right, so we got our hash browns about like we like them. Cooked. Once we got our hash browns done, we're gonna dump our sausage and bacon back in there. Oh, look at that bacony goodness. This is about three scrambled eggs with a little bit of milk in it. I'm just gonna pour that right over the top, just like you would with any other Mountain Man breakfast. This is Mountain Man breakfast for one. We're gonna put a little bit more Uncle Steve's Gator Shake on there. Get our lid on there, get a little spin. 
Now we're going to cook it at 325, which is uh, 16 coals. Five on the bottom and 11 on the top. Look, right there, there's five. Since all the little kitties are at home and need to learn how to do some math, let's all count together. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ten and eleven. Yes. So we'll bake that for about 20, 25 minutes. We'll come back, check it out, and we will add cheese. I will not forget the cheese this time. Maybe. Maggie, we need to add cheese. You like cheese, right? Don't let me forget the cheese. I don't have any cheese yet. But we'll have cheese in a little bit. All right, I'm gonna go play ball with the dog while uh, this cooks. I'm gonna turn it every uh, five to seven minutes. Told y'all wasn't gonna forget the cheese this time. All right, let's let that melt. Let's take a look and see what we got. All right, let's get a bite of this. Oh yeah, got some cheese, got some egg, got some bacon. Mm. Bacon. All right, is it Maggie approved? Not sure, Dad. Think I need another bite. Is that Maggie approved? I would say that's a yes, it's Maggie approved. All right, y'all. That's gonna do it for this week of Cast Iron Wednesday. The April Breakfast Challenge. Don't forget, there ain't no loving like Dutch oven loving. Now go wash your dang hands. <laughs> Stop making me laugh. What was it? You giggled back there when I started. <clears throat> Look that way. <laughs> Thank you. All right, that's a wrap.